to August run around. It should be a good time and a competitive environment for us. Who are some of those young guys that you've seen kind of stand out in uh, during this? Yeah, I mean, um, guys that you haven't seen a lot of, but um, that sh are showing some, some potential. I mean, you got Emmanuel uh, Agro, you got AJ Fel or, uh, Adrian Falconer, um, JP, and then we've got brought in a young guy, Devontae Young. Um, I haven't seen him too much lately, but uh, I know he's a talented kid that could help us down the road. No, with the loss of Devon, do you feel that you might have to find different ways to try and get the deep ball or, you know, find you know, than what you're used to in a sense? Or? Yeah, I mean, I'll, I mean, the coaches, you know, I think they, they're, I mean, obviously they're, they're, they're smart people. I mean, they'll, they'll figure something out, but um, yeah, we're definitely going to need some, some some more and some new playmakers this year, obviously with Tavon being gone, but, you know, that'll come with, with camp and practice and all that kind of stuff. With so much youth, Riley, is it... Is there, are you guys interchangeable? I know the upperclassmen probably are, but is it harder maybe for some of the younger guys to learn multiple positions? I mean, it is it is tough um, coming coming from high school and then learning not only just one position at the college level, but multiple. I mean, and, but but these guys are coming along. They're starting to learn, and and when they do learn, they won't be thinking so much about you know what the play, what they actually are have. They can look at the defense, you know, break down the defense before the play even starts. So um, it's a process, and every every young guy goes through it, and, and they'll get it. How about Jay and Germanic? I know those are two guys that have been on the depth chart and kind of maybe need to take that next step. Yeah, and, and this this uh, this camp will be a good opportunity for them to take it to the next level, and, and I know both of them have the potential to do that. So it, it'll be an exciting camp for both of them, and I, I look forward to big things for them this year. What's it like for you, being the old guy and having all these young guys around? Um, it's, it's been crazy. Um, I, you know, I was in their shoes at one point, but, you know, a snap of a finger, here I am as a senior, but um, it's been awesome. Awesome. Just to just to be able to teach these guys and be with them as they grow into um, you know pretty pretty good talented receivers that they they're capable of being and it's it's been cool to watch them come along and it's just like a different different side of the story for me. Thanks.